Hi guys, so this video is actually about converting your meta character into that of Lyra's character. So what you have to do first is go over here to your cell bridge. Get your meta humans from here. So all the meta humans that you have created in the past will be available here. So go to my meta humans. So I have currently three meta humans created. So what you have to do is once you download your meta character, you have to click on the export button. Okay. So you can choose your character, you can choose the quality over here, highest, medium or low, okay, and then click on export. So I have already exported my character here. So your characters will be available within the meta humans folder. So Nataria is my character. So the first thing that I do is I go open BP Nataria. So it will have a few functions, variables, and also the entire character will be shown here in the viewport. So you can just go and see that. So the first thing that you have to do is go click on the body and find out the kind of body that uh, Natalia actually has. So F medium NRW body. That is what is Meta Natalia. So save all just in case if it crashes. So that's the first step. Going to content. Let's go to characters, heroes and find out Mannequin UE4 and the animations. So ABP UE4 Mannequin Retarget. Let's open it. Yeah, this is the animation graph for UE4. Oh, we just closed it accidentally, but it's okay. Um, just going to retarget this, duplicate and retarget. So what we're going to do is we're going to use an IK retargeter. So let's choose um, UE4 Manny to UE5, or I think we can go with the RTG mannequin. So let's go with that. And then what we have to find is we need to find out F medium, F mid, NRW. So this is what we had in the body of Natalia. So choose that. So this is what we get. What we do is we just change it to the meta humans we create. Sorry, it's meta human 2. Meta humans, we create a new folder called retarget Natalia. Open that, okay, choose that, click on OK, and click on Retouch it. So now we have Natalia's character available over here. Next thing what we do is we go get back to Meta Humans, and now within the characters, you can see there is something called Cosmetics. Go to Cosmetics, and you can see B Manny, B Quinn are the two characters that are used over here in Unreal Engine. Okay, so not in, oh, sorry. Uh, which is used in Lyra. Okay, so what we do is we just right click, create a duplicate. So in case if something goes wrong, so I already have two meta characters uh, already available here. It's available, so I have already retargeted them. So let's just retarget this one from scratch. So what we do is we just click on the body. We are going to erase all these things. So this apparently belongs to <laughs> this character over here. So I'm going to remove everything. Okay, click on delete. And now in the mesh component, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to set it back to the default. So this is how it will be. Uh, we're going to remove all this data. Can't delete, delete, and delete. Okay, so this is what we will have. While, so let's see what's wrong here. Okay, it's because the construction script is an empty. Okay, compile and save this. So we don't have any issues right now. So this is Bequin. And now what we do is, we have to open our meta uh, meta human character. So get back to meta humans. We have retargeted Natalia. So Natalia over here, open Natalia. The first thing that we have to do is, we have to copy these variables into Bequin. So it's pretty easy. You just go click on the page variable, you get it. Second one is the Natalia second character. You just copy it and click on Bequin. Again, click page function. So you have, sorry base variable that's it so you have both these variables here similarly what you have to do is you have to copy these functions and paste it within the function so this wasn't supposed to be here <clears throat> maybe we didn't delete it so we just going to paste it again so ar get setup copy and over here again paste the function so you have those functions but the construction script is empty here and over here the construction script is actually available so what we do is we just copy this function and paste it here. 
One thing that I've noticed, do not click on the compile button. This is going to cause error because all these values are not available at the moment. So what we do is get back here, go to Natali, select all, unselect the root and Natalia. Okay, this is from the MetaHuman character. Copy it, get back to the mesh component over here and click on paste. So now you have Natalia here. Okay, so that's it with fixing the first part. Next, what we have to do is let's compile and save this. Let's get back to Natalia. So we had the retargeted Natalia over here. What I'm going to do is this is an animation blueprint. So I'm going to retarget it to Natalia anim bp, not retarget, rename. So now that's available here. Just click on save all. Yep, get back to Natalia. <clears throat> What we have to do now is get back to body. So F medium NRW body. What we're going to do is we have to fix the animation mode to animation blueprint. Get to animation blueprint, search for Natalia. And you can see, click on Natalia. Get to the mesh component. Again, we have to choose the same one, F med NRW body. Okay, let's wait. See, you can see the character getting overlapped over here. It's okay, we'll fix that in a minute. Getting to the animation blueprint, we get into Natalia. Go click on Natalia, click on compile and save. That's it with, uh, with the retargeting. Now let's click on the play button. So this is my first character. Let's see if the rest of the characters are spawned. So it will be actually chosen in random. So let's see. What are the characters we have? Okay, this time maybe Natalia wasn't available. Natalia is chosen. Yes, Natalia is chosen. So this is Natalia. And you can see the retarget has worked perfectly. So that is Natalia. Now what happens is you have this entire game to yourself and now you can start. Right? You can actually change the environments, anything with your new character. And you can see pretty much the graphics is really good. Also with a medium character, medium style character, it's really good. Okay, so much about Lyra, I'll discuss to you guys in a different video. So with that, thanks a lot guys.